Hi everyone, today in this video we will learn more about Loop's all new Shopify to Webflow app. This app just went live on the Shopify app store and you can install it using the link in the description below. This app empowers you to import all your Shopify data into Webflow CMS and then use that CMS to build headless Shopify stores hosted in Webflow without exporting a single line of code. So let's get started by first installing this app in your Shopify store. So as you can see on my screen, uh, this is the Shopify uh, app store listing and we will just click install. And then it will ask us to install it on our Shopify store and let's click install again. And then this will redirect you back to loop. So if you don't have an account, sign up. If you have an account, just log in to continue. So once you have logged in or signed up, it will ask you to select a store that you want to connect. So for this demo, I have created this store and I will just click on this. And what this does is it connects the Shopify store to your loop account. So next step is onboarding. So here you can see it says reconnect for me because I have already connected to Webflow for different uh, stores. But for you, it will just say connect. But every time you want to add a new store, I recommend click to reconnect and then select the workspace or all the Webflow projects that you want to give access to loop. So for this case, I will just select my workspace and then authorize the app. So now what this has done is it has given loop access to all the websites in my workspace so now it is asking us which exact project you want to connect to the shopify store so here i know that i want to connect this one youtube loop Nufi, and then i will just hit connect and then just give it a couple of seconds and then it will talk to webflow api and connect your cms with shopify and then here you can see now it's connected and then we can go to our dashboard. So this is our loop dashboard. This is where we manage our Webflow and Shopify integration. In this dashboard, you can see you can import product and variants. You can import collections and you can also sync the Shopify policies. And to do this, loop already have created three Webflow CMS collections in your project products, collection, and variants. This is where it's going to bring all the data from Shopify and put it. And then you can use this data to build a headless store in Shopify. So in this video, we learned how we can install Loop's Shopify to Webflow app and then connect it to a Webflow project. So in next videos, we will use Webflow app to build a headless Shopify store with the Shopify powered cart and checkout. So please subscribe and stay tuned for new videos.